Hey everybody, welcome to Shooting Gear Reviews, straight up guns and gear reviews. Today we are checking out some air guns that are more powerful than a 9mm. Right now what I've got in my hands is an AEA HP Max 45 caliber air gun. This is almost more like a pistol, especially when you fold the stock. That's why I call this thing the freaking hand cannon right here. So. What are we gonna do? How are we gonna demonstrate this power? Well, you see behind me right here, we've got some cinder block action. So we're gonna start actually with just a 22, shooting a 40 grain snub nose at about 1200 feet a second. We're gonna step it up from there to a nine mil, shooting 115 grain at a little over 1100 feet a second. And then we are gonna cap it off with the 45 cal. And maybe, I don't know guys, stay tuned to the end of the video. Maybe we'll have something even more powerful, more impressive to uh, cap the video off with for some icing on the cake there at the end. So here it is guys, air guns, more powerful, than powder burners. Air guns more powerful than a 9mm. Alright, so that's what one shot of 22 long rifle will do to a cinder block. I've got nine more in here, so that's not enough for me. Uh, definitely, obviously, not enough to destroy the block, but let's see if nine more will do it. All right, well, 10 shots of 22 start to do something to a cinder block. We made a couple all the way through and start to almost get through the backside. Nice size hole in the front and really some pretty considerable damage. So, uh, but I mean, that's 10 rapid fire shots. Let's get another fresh brick out here. Set this one off to the side and let's see what a nine mil will do. This is just a standard 9mm like most people would carry for personal defense. Today I'm running some regular practice ammo in it because I figured the because I figured the self-defense ammo would spread out too much. This round nose practice ammo is probably gonna put a better dent in that brick. Let's see if it does. All right, so found the found the bullet, went right through this cinder block. Uh, didn't stand up on the first side to one shot of the nine mil. Went all the way through, but didn't even leave a dent in the back side. Just bounced off and landed out on the ground over there. So, I mean, I wouldn't really call that too much damage to the brick, would you? No. All right, so here we are, 19 shots in with a nine mil on a cinder block and you can see it pretty much came apart. Uh, so as with our 22 cinder block, there was a little bit left. That one is pretty much just dust here, rubble in the shooting area. Let's get another block. And now it's time to up the power by going to an air gun. This is gonna be cool guys, check this out. There's the air gun. There's the big old nasty slug I'm shooting out of it. Let's see what it does to the cinder block, eh?
right. Well, there you go. Two shots will crumble a brick with this guy right here. There you go, guys. Two shots with a 45 cal AEA pushing about 300 foot pounds. Now, that's 100 foot pounds more than your average 9 mil, so definitely this is more powerful than your 9 mil handgun for sure. But I have a feeling we can get even more powerful than that, and I think that you guys would probably like to see that. So uh, let's do that next. All right, getting another cinder block for this bad boy right here. The AEA Zeus 72 cal monster. With that 45 cal, I know that we're not maybe too much larger than a 9 mil. And this is obviously quite a bit larger than a 9 mil, but it's also quite a bit more powerful. It's quite a bit more powerful than a lot of firearms, actually, than a lot of your guns out there. It's got more power. It's 72 cal. We're going to explode this cinder block. Watch this, you guys. Action. All right, there is the 72 cal. This All right. Oh, yeah. One shot. Well, there you go. There's an air gun right there that's way, way, way more powerful than a 9mm. Smokes your 9mm. It's just the follow up shots that are a little bit, a little bit less enchanting. But hey, that first brick exploding shot, man, that's money right there. So. I don't know, what would you guys rather grab when you're trying to face off some zombies? One of these or a 9mm? I don't know, I'd rather have both. I'd rather have a whole arsenal, but... Anyways, that was a whole lot of fun. I hope you guys had a whole lot of fun today. I definitely proved a point. And uh, if you like this video right here and you like watching stuff get blown up with powerful air guns, definitely check this one out right up here. More big time explosions with big time air guns. I'll see you guys over there.